investigating a homicide in the same area where a mother and her children have been reported missing. You're watching WBTV News at 6. I'm Siobhan Bryan. This homicide investigation happening in the 400th block of Orchard Trace Lane. Again, this is in Northeast Charlotte. We have it mapped it out for you here on your screen. It's near Reagan Drive off of North Tryon Street. You may remember this is the same area where a Charlotte mother and her children were reported missing back on March 3rd. Their pictures are on your screen. This is Markayla Johnson and her children, Miracle and Messiah. We've reported on their mysterious disappearance multiple times. WBTV's Ron Lee is live right now trying to learn whether this homicide investigation is connected to the missing family in any way. Ron? And I can tell you that is the big mystery out here and neighbors are very concerned that this may be the family or at least part of the family. Investigators have been out here for quite some time. I want to go ahead and step off to the side and kind of show you what's going on right now. Dozens of officers and crime scene detectives are here investigating after they say at least one body was found in an enclosed space at or near the same apartment where an entire family disappeared just last week. 22 year old Mar Markayla Johnson, her four year old daughter, and seven-month-old son Miracle disappeared from the same apartment building just a few days ago. Neighbors I talked to tell me Johnson's boyfriend also has not been seen in days. Now, police aren't saying if the human remains that were found are that of the family or how many bodies have been located at this point. Neighbors are absolutely stunned right now and are hoping the best for that missing family. We did talk to investigators a short time ago, and here's what Captain Tori Ellis told us. In their investigation, they located what they believe was human remains. At that point, we uh, went and signed warrants. Further warrants are actually being sought out to do a further, deeper investigation on what was actually found with this situation. Now, obviously, the investigation here is in its infancy. There is a lot to go, and they will be here for quite some time, as will we. We will stay out on scene and make sure to report to you as soon as we hear anything new. For now, I'm Ron Lee. WBTV, on your side. Ron, thank you.